These are the annulment papers that you asked me to prepare. We only have to talk to your husband, so we can already begin the process. But from what I can see, it would be best for you to think very carefully about this decision of yours first, Miss Olivia. I have to warn you, ma'am. The process won't be easy. Aside from that, the division of properties will be more fair towards you, Miss Olivia. What do you mean by that? What I'm trying to say, ma'am, given the history of the company that your late father has built, along with all the other properties that were originally yours, if the annulment gets granted, you'll have to divide everything equally with your husband. That's my company attorney. I want to pass it on to my kids. You see, the law sees you and Sir Victor as a married couple, so all of your properties are considered conjugal, Miss Olivia. And I have to say, that includes the company. No, I can't. I can't share anything with that woman. <laughs> Those are our properties, attorney, my families. The only solution I can think of so that the situation turns to be in your favor is to not push through with your annulment. Maybe try to work it out with your husband. The two of you should try to fix your relationship. Besides, when your husband Victor is already gone, you'll get all of these properties back anyway. That is if he won't decide to hand down anything to his other kid. I can't do this to my children. That's why I strongly suggest that if you can still endure all that's been happening, don't think twice in doing so. It will save you all the trouble. My children will only get hurt if Victor and I separate. That's why, before we begin with the process, you have to be very sure. Is this really what you want? I don't know if the decision I made back then was right. But you knew I loved you, Victor. How can you leave me with a lot of problems like this? Isn't it enough that you made me share with your mistress? And now this? It's a good thing you're dead. Now you can't stop me from doing whatever I want to do to your mistress. <laughs> 